Okay, what I want to discuss with you guys right now is the uphill lie golf shot, okay? Anytime you're on uneven lies, there is a difference of what we have to do with our setup and or our swing. So what I want you guys to understand here is I'm on a pretty good upslope here, and this is about the angle of the slope. So what I've got here is I've got about 160 yards to the hole. Um, I've got an 8-iron in my hand. And now typically understand that when the, you're on the upslope, the ball will follow the slope. So what does that mean? You're on an upslope, the ball's going to go higher here. So you have to basically play for that. Typically, you're going to have to take more club. Now, I would normally, but as you can see, my shirt is kind of blowing here. I'm a little bit downwind, so that's going to sort of counteract it. It's going to carry it a little bit further. So um, typically, if I'm on an upslope, again, I'm going to take more club. It's acting off. So this 8-iron is, in essence, being turned into a 9. But thankfully, with the wind being downwind, I can actually just hit the eight. If this was into the wind and I'm on an upslope and let's say it's an eight iron shot, I'm probably going to have to take a six iron. Because one, I'm going to have to take seven iron because the slope and then with the wind coming into me even more, it's going to kill me. So what I've got here, so remember, when we're on a side hill lie, a couple rules. Match your hips and shoulders to the slope. So if this is my normal setup, I'm going to take my hips and shoulders and go this way. Play the ball towards the higher foot and then swing along the slope. So what I'm going to do here is kind of feel like I'm matching the slope. I don't want to get into the slope here and drive the club into the ground. Now, one little tip. This is a bonus tip for you guys. What I like to see you guys do on any slope, side hill, downhill, whatever the case is, I like three-quarter swings. The reason I like three-quarter swings is it's more controlled. Typically, you're swinging a little bit easier, which is going to take side spin off. So if the ball's below your feet, you're swinging a little bit easier. You're not hitting it as hard. That means less side spin, so you can control it. So I'm just going to hit a three-quarter shot here with my eight iron. And because of the slope and because of the wind, it'll work out. So here we go. Match the hips and shoulders to the slope. Three-quarter swing. Okay. And that worked out pretty good, pin high. It's a little bit left, but that's okay. And that's something that you'll have to figure out with you. Typically on upslopes, you'll have a tendency to pull it. The reason that is is because you don't get your weight enough to your left. Down slopes, you'll have a tendency to kind of squeeze it out to the right. So understand your tendencies, and if you understand how to play these slopes, it can really help you avoid the big numbers and shave strokes from your game.